Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix blur, uh, blurry screen on Windows 10 and 11. So, first of all, you just need to go to uh, System or Settings, and then you need to uh, go to System and Display and make sure that Scale and Layout is on Recommended and also on Display Resolution is on Recommended as well. And then you can go to uh, Graphic Settings and let's say you have a blurry screen on uh, some sort of game or app uh, you can for example i have a blurry sc screen on apex legends so what i can do here i can select options and set up as a high performance here and if you don't see the app that has the blurry screen you can go to browse here and add it manually here right so make sure to uh, set up the high performance if you want to here and another thing that you can do here, you can go to view advanced uh, system settings. And once you're here, make sure to be on advanced, then go to performance and make sure to select adjust for best appearance and then press apply and OK. And uh, another thing that you can do here, uh, if you have blurry screen on the app or the game, you can adjust API settings. So let's say I'm having blurry screen on Steam. So just uh, search the app and then right click on it, go to uh, open file location here and then go to properties and then compatibility and then go to change high DPI settings. Make sure to use this one, select this one and then uh, select this one high DPI scaling all right and then make sure to select application here, right? And then restart your computer and see if the problem fixed or not. And uh, another thing that you can do here, uh, you can update your uh, graphic driver. So what you can do here, you can go to device manager and then you need to select display adapters here and uh, select it, go to update driver and press browse my computer for drivers and then press let me pick the list of uh, available drivers on my computer and then you need to install uh, the one that is uh, as you can see here selected for me is this one press next as you can see here it's installing and after it's installed um, uh, just restart your computer and see if the problem persists or not all right so that's pretty much it and if i help you out please press like button and subscribe for more take care bye